All right, here we're looking at language Q22 Wednesday. Sort the nouns. Common. Common noun is kind of like candy, right? It just names a general group, whereas in a proper noun is a specific name brand of a candy, like Snickers. Another example, common noun would be car. A proper noun would be Ford or Chevy. Common noun would be team. Proper noun would be Padres, right? So common noun would just be butterfly, dirt, and country. Because it's not naming a specific kind of butterfly, specific kind of dirt, and then it's not naming a specific country. Another thing to remember is proper nouns are always capitalized. Proper nouns are always capitalized. Underline the adverb in the sentence. Sometimes it describes the eating. Sometimes eat. When do they eat? Sometimes. Change the verb to past tense. The caterpillar eats the leaf. Eats the leaf. This is called subject verb agreement. Caterpillar is singular, so you have to put it with the singular verb with an S at the end. We took notes on this somewhere. Let me find it. Verbs that end in S are singular, whereas in verbs that do not end in S are plural. It's the opposite of nouns. Normally, when there's an S at the end, it's plural, right? Not for verbs. When there's an S at the end, it's actually singular. It's the opposite. So if you look at the question, caterpillar. How many caterpillars is that? Singular. So you got to make sure you put the singular verb with it. Singular verbs end in an S. Singular verbs end in an S. Okay, underline the correctly spelled words. <coughs> Glue, new, true, and chew. There will probably be a question on the test where you have to match the singular noun with the singular verb or the plural noun with the plural verb. You should be taking the practice test tonight. Which word best completes the sentence? Carlos had to rewrite. He had to do it again. Re means again. The plural form of child is children. Children. Complete the sentence using the correct noun. My neighbor... Have a backyard sign or my neighbors have a backyard sign. Neighbors. Have is plural. Has is singular. How many neighbors do we have? More than one. It's plural. So you have to put it with the plural have. If there was one neighbor, my neighbor, then it would be my neighbor has, because there's only one neighbor. Has is singular. Have is plural. So because the subject, neighbors, is plural, 
you have to put it with the plural verb. All right, hopefully that helps you with Wednesday's Q22 language homework.